Okay, YouTube. Back to go over this again. Don't ever buy a Samsung phone. They're absolute pieces of shit. S6 Edge shit coming on all the time. Anyway, I got a line level set up. Because every course, as you go higher, you know, your blocks, as far as the straight edge goes, moves to the towards the hill an inch, you know? And if you step down, of course, it moves away from the hill. So it's good to be level with your straight edge with one course. But then when you step down, keep in mind, it'd been better for me to step up, but I already started at the far end there, and I'm stepping down, so it turns into be a real pain in the ass. But anyway, as I step down that bottom block there, that's a step down. Keep in mind, I've got some really large rock here. And uh, if this line's level, if you see there, I can measure down 8 inches, and I know that's the top of that next row that's going down. You know, it's it's one row lower, and it has to be offset front to back, or you know, lengthwise by half a block. So what I did was, let me see if I can show you this. Before I filled in all this rock to the top of it, I just measured over uh, 25 inches to the next edge. These are 17 inch blocks or whatever, you know. But so that means that this row here that's up higher. It'll land right here in the middle because I'll be 34 inches. I'll be in the middle of this block, which is good, right? Because this row here, let me get you a better shot of it. This is a step down row. And before I filled in that middle, you know, I'm sitting on top six inches of rock. Got my drain tile rock in front, rock in back. And so I just, since the string's level, I just measure down eight inches. Then I bring it out 25 inches from this front edge there to the edge of this block or to the middle 34 inches you know that way this row here will come and you know be down here and I'll just continue on with this row that step down you know it steps down one it'll continue all the way down that way and maybe one more step down you know because you want this first course see it's quite a bit lower than my ground level and you're like well what the hell is that all about well You've got to have something right here in front of this block. This is These first two rows are real important, especially this first one. In case it starts wanting to push, it's got to have something to push again. If you just lay it on top of the ground or on top of the dirt, it doesn't have anything in front of it to hold it here. So anyway, if you look down here, I'll get a little better angle. When I step down, I'm down below grade level, about probably four or five inches. But as I'm heading down the hill, it'll start sticking out like that one kind of sticks out halfway. Don't like that, but that's okay. But anyway, keep stepping down. Keep this first course buried down in the ground. That's going to hold your, going to hold your hill. And then you got to have your drain tile. Big long roll, big anaconda handed across the yard. It'll head on down that way. Got lots of rock here. A good base. I got ten ton of rock sitting here, and it's an eighty foot wall all together, counting the corners. And then. I got 10 ton of rock sitting here, big large rock, one one inch down, supposed to be one inch only, but you know, these quarries here in this hillbilly ass town of Atchison. And then I got some three quarter inch rock, 10 ton there. And we just start, you know, going. This drain tile started at the top, moves all its way down, got rock out here in front, real important. Let's water come underneath and around. Every cell needs to be packed to the top. You don't have wasp nests and whatever else wants to try to live there. But anyway, just that's how I found out the best way to do a step down is I got a 60, 64 inches away from that corner there. And I measured out 64 inches and that's where I did my step down. That's the edge of that block. Of course, that was back here a ways. But uh, it was much easier to go ahead and figure out where to place that block at when I'm doing the step down than trying to tunnel underneath and put a block halfway underneath it or cut a block in half and do a half block so you have proper overlap then that's not very strong so anyway this system here seemed to work a lot better and and that goes for like if you're stepping up also if you're headed coming up the hill it'd probably be better and you just keep stepping up and boom 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 no problem right keep your drain tile in there rock all around it it'd be a perfect world